Hi, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will demonstrate how to view current location from smartphone on a Node Red dashboard using the Own Tracks app. This is the concept. On the smartphone, we'll use Own Tracks to obtain the current location. Then, from Own Tracks, the location data will be published to an MQTT broker. Node Red will subscribe to receive the location data sent by own tracks. Then, the location data will be displayed in Node Red using a map, along with several other visualizations such as a gauge and text. In Node Red, after installing the Node Red dashboard, we need an additional node called World Map. Please search for it in the Manage Palette section by typing Node Red Contrib Web World Map and then click on Install. For further details on how to use the world map node, please visit the page on flow.node-red.org. This is the official page of OwnTracks at OwnTracks.org. To install it on Android, click on OwnTracks for Android, which will direct you to the Google Play Store page. Click on Install to begin installing OwnTracks on your Android device. This is the welcome page when you first open the Own Tracks app. Follow the instructions to start configuring the MQTT connection. Open Preferences and fill in the parameters to connect to your MQTT broker. For data transmission, which is the monitoring mode, there are several options. In this video, I'm using the move option to increase the frequency of data monitoring sent. To learn how to use own tracks, including the data it sends via MQTT, you can access the booklet page on the own tracks website.
Here is a simple node red flow code that is used, starting with the MQTT and node to receive MQTT data from own tracks, setting up the MQTT broker used, and using the following topic to receive all data from own tracks. When connected from the MQTT in, to the debug node, will receive the payload structure obtained from MQTT, which includes data such as latitude, longitude, battery level, and other relevant information. This is what we'll utilize for visualization on the map and gauge. From the MQTT in node, the payload will be sent to a function node. In this function node, I create several variables from the payload obtained to be used in visualizing the map, gauge, and text. The message. Payload is the payload that will be sent to the world map node to display the location on the map. This is the configuration of the world map node to display the location on the map. Next, I'm using a gauge to display the battery level and speed. For altitude information and battery status, I'm utilizing text nodes. And here is the node red dashboard view that will display the map along with other information such as speed, battery level, altitude, and battery status. From this video, we learned that by using the own tracks app on Android along with Node Red, we can monitor our current location on a Node Red dashboard. The communication protocol used is MQTT. This is a simple example of using the own tracks application, and we can further develop more complex applications. Thank you for watching, and I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. See you in the next video.